Hi, I'm NASA Kennedy's Lauren Lass, and I'm taking you inside KSC. NASA led Boeing and United Launch Alliance in an escape and triage simulation at Space Launch Complex 41 at Cape Canaveral Air Force Station on July 24th. The exercise was designed to rehearse how, in the unlikely event of an emergency, astronauts can safely escape the launch pad and reach a nearby staging area for medical attention. They used a modified zip line to evacuate the pad, then drove a tank-like vehicle to a helipad, where in a real-life scenario, they could be airlifted to a hospital. The simulation is one of several being conducted by NASA with commercial crew partners Boeing and SpaceX to ensure astronaut safety. NASA's iconic Vehicle Assembly Building and its designers have been recognized for their extraordinary role in the U.S. space program. The Florida Association of the American Institute of Architects presented the Test of Time Award to Kelvin Manning, Kennedy Space Center's Associate Director for Technical. It happened on July 27th at the organization's Florida Convention and Trade Show in Orlando. The 525-foot-tall facility served the Apollo and Space Shuttle programs. It continues to dominate the Space Coast skyline and will host the assembly of the Space Launch System rockets that will fly Artemis missions to the moon. And remember, Spaceport Magazine digs deeper inside KSC.